Well, howdy, howdy, I'm back. Uh, I was going to do an Independence Day <coughs> motif here. Uh, Tom, they're going down all over the world. Uh, referring to deer clops. Uh, okay, I've been thinking about a lot of things after uh, playing through winter. Uh, my immediate thought is to go ahead and play through another winter as Wilson and uh, try to kill deer clops. Now, uh, I was going to do an Independence Day kind of opening. They're going down all over the world, Tom. <laughs> but uh, 24K gold ring and uh, also Frodo 011 and maybe one more one on that. But uh, 24K gold ring and, and Frodo with some, some numbers behind him. Both... Uh, <coughs> Stun locked deer clops, and I've heard that called shock locked and stun locked both, and I've seen it both ways. So, uh, but anyway, they just wound up whacking him, and if you keep whacking him, he's well, uh, I think uh, 24k gold ring described it best. He's like uh, a tall bird, and he just stands there and you beat the crap out of him. Uh, 24k gold ring did add that his sanity was down to zero because remember your sanity drops fighting any monster. Let me get some clue for a fix here. Now, I'm not doing this grass just for something to do, but uh, I noticed the grass was one of the key elements for uh, winter. Although I probably had a lot more everything that, you know, you can't know until you experience something. But anyway, evidently, they took pigs off a of stun lock and put deer clops on it. So, yeah, you can uh, make sure he does that hit or maybe even before that when he's just running around. They just go up and just beat the crap out of him. <laughs> it's just, now, crap, I didn't write it down. Somebody got him two times in one winter. And uh, that just really... I just really, it kind of still irritates me that I missed my chance at him, but that is what it is. But that's kind of why I think I'll hang out as Wilson for a while. Now, this world won't ever have the Matusks in it. Uh, Kevin said you get, of course, Kevin's such a great source of information because uh, he said all the worlds I have that don't have tall birds do, so. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. But I was going to go see if there's mosquitoes. I think it might have been 24K Gold Ring got his uh, ice gem off one of his first hounds. So, now there was a grass chest out here. Well, actually, if I'm not going to fix that black wall, stone's not a priority, so... I'm trying to kind of get myself back together. This, I haven't adapted to all the game elements. There was just a lot thrown in at once. And uh, what the developers are actually saying, uh, I've read a few forums before I came in tonight. What they're actually saying is that's how it's going to be with the beta game. And uh, we hope you come back after we finish the game if you don't like that everything can change with every update. So, as far as the what they're saying is that you know they're doing they in order to get the game they want they have to do very daring and uh, you know unpopular with many players things and uh, or some players things and that's what they're going to do, which of course you know is their game. So, so I've got this infinite dust thing. Like I said, I played all at once. That whole winter prelude, 20 days before winter and winter, was all one play session. So, I don't have a hot clue where I am or what I'm doing at this point. I know winter ended, I think, on day 318. I've got it written down somewhere. I did start a Willow World after I finally got everything. See, normally I go to bed and just toss everything in to upload and then I do it. But 
I figured you wouldn't want to watch part of winter, and you know, I'm sure I thought everybody would really want to see deer clops, and so I sat up an extra three hours while all that stuff uploaded, and then I slept about 16, and that's not all videos, part of that's just uh, winter's very hard for me. A real winter in my real world that I live in. <laughs> oh, crap, I just... I am not at all used to these days yet. I was thinking actually with the hounds, I could run them out to the beehives, I could run them up to the bee below. I'm thinking about, in a sense, abandoning this camp and just moving closer to the bee below. You know, the game has changed and who the hell knew. And uh, it might be a lot better to just be up there. And there's no reason for that science machine to be out there. I don't know if any of you, it may not even be in the film, but uh, when I uh, built the walls and put the floor in, it was in the way, and I just got rid of the damn thing. And then with the update, I needed to, uh, well, I needed a science machine. Now, we have this blowgun. We've got some snowbird feathers. I'm going to go see if my... Kevin said that, like I said, the game should have everything except the McTuss. So, I hate eating... Uh, I hate eating honey ham when I don't have to. And I haven't, I haven't got my head on a swivel or anything in it. Damn, it's dark over there now. And another log won't matter. Now somebody said they, they were still having problems with winter and I full alright, all that crap's just honey. I fully understand that, but I can't push a button in my game and get winter. I I don't have like the developer mod. So uh, I wish I could. I'd really I've got an unfinished business with a certain large one eyed son of a bitch. But uh, I put up a bunch of, I'm not being cold-blooded about that, I put up a bunch of hints that, you know, that seem to uh, fit for things to do. It seemed to me that one of the biggest things is if you've built, number one, you ought to plan your forest. And by forest, I mean any tree you plant anywhere, okay? Because you might want to space some forest, some trees out. So that instead of dropping, let's see what a fire is here. How much is in a fire? Uh, fire is three grass and two logs. So instead of dropping that to get warm, if you've got a few trees where they won't cause a forest fire, just lone trees standing here and there where you think you're going to be traveling, then uh, that's a good thing. And also you want them around your camp to where you can get to them. I'm kind of thinking about fixing this hole in the wall. Like I said, I'm so goddamn disorganized now that it's not even funny anymore. So theoretically, if you had to go to the... Uh, if you had to go to the beefalo at night, you could have a torch in your hand and a hat on your head. See, I'm a... Oh, and somebody burned these trees. I wonder how that happened. <laughs> I have to come up here and cut this crap. Boy, this... Every burned tree you see is the difference between old Wilson being alive today and not being alive. Oh, what I was thinking about doing, and I shouldn't... Uh, we'll chop that one or something. I don't know. I guess if I use it, it will be because I'm in deep shit anyway. That's uh, French for an undesirable situation. And I haven't fixed all this stuff up here yet either. I kind of almost stopped picking up seeds because they don't do a damn thing. I wish I had one of those axes. So what's up here? Good armor, a winter hat. Let's bring up one of the vests. Just put 
Now, as far as I know, they didn't do anything about the magic crockpots. Actually, you know what? A fire pit up here might be a lifesaver. Uh, well, actually, if I build a... what I, Did I say I was going to think about building a camp closer to the beefalo? Now, do I want it to be night or not? I got mixed feelings. Actually, I don't think those two hours are going to change my life. Um... Now, you probably know that's more than... I usually don't fill the old food meter, but I'm not really worried about it. Shit. I've just been really disoriented. All right, the beefalo actually... Well, how far are we from camp? I may go get a horn, but I want to go see... Uh, um, there was an ice hound incident up here somewhere. I don't think it could have been much further up than this. I should have looked at a picture of ice cream. I was kind of thinking that I would probably recognize it. I am going to get rid of that other spider nest before winter. There's just no reason I have it. I'm trying to simplify my life. What have I got there? I can just plant a tree here, screw it. I want that tree. Hey, Bicolo! You doing Bicolo stuff? That's pretty logical since you're Bicolo. Actually, I need my hell in that damn rock. Ain't that a bitch? You guys are just rowdy today, huh? Well, I think of the many things that are up here, I don't think an ice gem is one of them. I do think, I, uh, as time permits, as like I said, Saddam was kind enough to suggest, uh, I probably will do a winter game to uh, just... Uh, roll it off from the get-go, although I'll tell you what, I may go ahead. I don't normally play Woofies, but I might play Woofies because uh, that that Willow thing, uh, she's like on spider control indefinitely. It's like, uh, okay. And when you burn them, you don't get the silk. The problem is she's got a dozen nests. Uh, I did burn them, but when you burn them, it turns loose one warrior and one regular spider. So I have 12 regular spiders and 12 warrior spiders all in this very small area. And it's like, uh, okay. I think I can just use this from here. Alright. I never thought I'd see this day. Bringing the beefalo home. Now, I am aware that when they're in heat, they're not very good about moving, but trying to wait for them to get out of heat is like... So we're down about to where I resurrect. I'm going to have to put a beef on that up here. I think I've got one up. Come on, beefalo. I am your beefalo leader. I am the king of beefalo. Heed my words. Follow my little beefalo ass down here. Quit killing my livestock. Of course, this will necessitate where, well, I was just about where I needed to wear the hat anyway when I was harvesting, so. Yes, Bigelow. We are migrating. We are moving on to fertile lands in the south. Now, where the hell are we? Since I've been planting all these damn trees, everything looks alike. Where is my camp? All right, that's my camp. I don't really want them in the traps. So, yeah, this, uh... Yeah. Except for the obvious problems of never being able to take Chester through here. That, and I, I don't know to what degree they drift back. I guess we'll find out. So, actually, we've only got 12 days left, so this isn't a bad idea. 
If you're new to the game, this was instituted, these birds in cages to, uh, you can feed them any vegetable or yeah, anything you grow and they'll poop out the seeds. And originally what they would do is they would poop out two of whatever seed you put in them. And they decided that was overpowered because you know how, how, how deadly seeds can be in a game. <laughs> So they made it, sometimes they poop one, sometimes they poop two, sometimes they poop what you feed them, sometimes they poop something else. But, uh, <clears throat> and I've gone like a day and a half to get like a half dozen seeds of one kind out of one, one plant. So it's not something I highly recommend. But, uh, if, uh, the cookies, you gotta have the, uh, the pumpkins, so, and that's the way to do it, so.